Welcome to Tally Help videos. In this video, you will learn how to import masters or transactions from your Excel files into Tally Prime using mapping templates. Use the templates to feed in details of your stock items, sales, purchases, purchase or sales orders, attendance, payroll, and so on, and smoothly import them into Tally Prime. First, let's see how you can create your own mapping template. Let's say you have maintained details of your stock items in an Excel file. As you can see, the Excel file has stock item details like the item name, quantity, rate, and other necessary details to keep track of your inventory. Let's create a mapping template for the Excel file. Press Alt plus O, Import. Manage. Mapping Templates Create under Masters As you can see, the Mapping Template creation screen appears. Here you can ensure that your Excel file is stored in the correct location. Specify the file path. From the list of files, select the required Excel file to import that contains your stock items, say item list.xlsx. The list of worksheets will contain all the worksheets in the selected Excel file. Select the one that you wish to map. In this case, select Sheet 1. Now, proceed to create the mapping template. In this mapping template creation screen, you can customize the mapping template to import your stock items into Tally Prime. By default, the mapping template is saved for all companies in Tally Prime. This allows you to access the mapping template from any company that you may have created in Tally Prime. In case you want to use this template only for this company, press backspace to change it to this company. Enter a name for the mapping template that you are creating, say stock items. Specify the type of master for which you are creating the mapping template, say stock items in this case. The options related to the Excel columns and rows are prefilled. However, you can change it as per your Excel data. Under Field, Tally Prime, select the field in Tally Prime and map it to the column header, Excel, that stands for the same. Since you are importing stock items, mapping the name field is mandatory for importing into Tally Prime. Select name and map it to the column header that stands for the same in your Excel file, item name. Then, select units and map it to the unit of measurement column header. Similarly, map opening balance quantity, opening balance rate, and opening balance value to the respective quantity, rate, and value column headers available in your Excel sheet. Once you are done with mapping the fields and column headers, accept the screen to save the template. Now, let's use this mapping template to import your stock items into Tally Prime in just a few simple steps. Press Alt plus O, Import. Masters. The import data screen appears. Select Excel spreadsheet as the file format. The file path is pre-filled with the location configured under Import, Configuration, Location of Import Export Files. Under File to Import, select Item List.xlsx from the list of files. From the list of worksheets, choose Sheet 1. From the list of mapping templates, select Stock Items. It is possible that your existing company data has the same set of masters as in the Excel file. In this situation, you can choose to Combine Opening Balance. The opening balance of the existing master and the imported master will be combined. Ignore duplicates. Any duplicate of the existing master in Excel format will be ignored. Modify with new data. The imported master will replace the existing master. You can preview the data to be imported by enabling the preview import summary. Don't forget to configure the backup settings before proceeding. 
It's recommended to take a backup before importing. Enabling the backup company data before import option safeguards your company data. In the backup destination path, simply specify where you want to store the backup of your company data. Press I, Import, to proceed with importing your transactions into Tally Prime. Once the stock items are imported successfully, you can see them in the chart of accounts. Now, let's see how to create a mapping template for importing your transactions into Tally Prime. Let's say you have maintained an Excel sheet for recording sales transactions. As you can see in this Excel file, each column represents a specific information about the transaction and each row represents one single transaction. Let's create a mapping template for the Excel file. Press Alt plus O, Import. Manage. Mapping templates. Create under Transactions. As you can see, the mapping template creation screen appears. Here you can ensure that your Excel file is stored in the correct location. Specify the file path. From the list of files, select the required Excel file to import that contains your vouchers, say sales transactions q1.xlsx. The list of worksheets will contain all the worksheets in the selected Excel file. Select the one that you wish to map. In this case, select sales bills. Now, proceed to create the mapping template. In this mapping template creation screen, you can customize the mapping template to import your transactions into Tally Prime. By default, the mapping template is saved for all companies in Tally Prime. Enter a name for the mapping template that you are creating, say Sales Q1. Specify the type of voucher for which you are creating the mapping template, say Accounting Vouchers. Now, you may have entered data for sales transactions in multiple rows in your Excel file. Say, the ledgers and the respective amounts are mentioned in different rows for the same transaction. Since you are importing vouchers, mapping the voucher type name, voucher date, ledger name, and ledger amount is mandatory for importing into Tally Prime. In the mapping template creation screen, map voucher type name, voucher date, and voucher number to the voucher type, date, and invoice number column headers available in the Excel file. Now, select ledger entries repeated in multiple rows. Select ledger name and map it to the ledger name column header. Then, select ledger amount and map it to the ledger amount column header. Select ledger amount debit or credit and map it to the debit or credit column header. Similarly, map other required fields with their respective column headers available in your Excel file. Once you are done with mapping the fields and column headers, accept the screen to save the template. Now, let's use this mapping template to import your sales transactions into Tally Prime in just a few simple steps. Press Alt plus O, Import. Transactions. The import data screen appears. Select Excel Spreadsheet as the file format. The file path is pre-filled with the location configured under Import, Configuration, Location of Import slash Export Files. Under File to Import, select Sales Transactions Q1.xlsx from the list of files. From the list of worksheets, select Sales Bills. From the list of mapping templates, select Sales Q1. The type of voucher will be prefilled based on its selection by creating the mapping template. You can preview the data to be imported by enabling the preview import summary. Press I, Import, to proceed with importing your transactions into Tally Prime. Once the transaction data is imported successfully, you can see those transactions in your daybook. 
Now, you may have entered data for sales transactions in fixed columns in your Excel file. Let's see how we can create a mapping template for such entries. Say you have entered the ledgers and respective amounts in varied columns in your Excel file. You may have entered the top ledger details like party name, party amount and so on as well as bottom ledger details like discount ledgers, tax ledgers and so on in different columns in your Excel sheet without grouping them. Let's create a mapping template for the Excel file. Press Alt plus O import manage mapping templates create under transactions as you can see the mapping template creation screen appears here you can ensure that your excel file is stored in the correct location specify the file path from the list of files select the required excel file to import that contains your vouchers see sales transactions.xlsx the list of worksheets will contain all the worksheets in the selected Excel file. Select the one that you wish to map. In this case, select invoices. Now, proceed to create the mapping template. In this mapping template creation screen, you can customize the mapping template to import your transactions into Tally Prime. By default, the mapping template is saved for all companies in Tally Prime. Enter a name for the mapping template that you are creating, say Sales Q2. Specify the type of voucher for which you are creating the mapping template, say Accounting Vouchers. Map Voucher Type Name Voucher Date and Voucher Number to the Voucher Type, Date and Invoice Number column headers available in the Excel file. Select ledger details from fixed columns to easily group your data according to how it appears in the sales voucher. Select top ledger, party, cash, bank and so on. Select ledger name and map it to the party name column header. Select ledger amount and map it to the invoice slash voucher net amount column header. Now select bottom ledger, tax, discount and so on. Select ledger name, choose specify fixed field value and specify the value as sales. Then select ledger amount and map it to the value column header. Similarly, select item name and map it to the item name column header. Then select build quantity and map it to the quantity column header. Select item rate and map it to the rate column header. Lastly, select item amount and map it to the value column header. Similarly, select bottom ledger, tax, discount and so on again to map for the tax ledgers based on your Excel data. Once you are done with mapping the fields and column headers, accept the screen to save the template. Now, let's use this mapping template to import your sales transactions into Tally Prime in just a few simple steps. Press Alt plus O, Import. Transactions. The import data screen appears. Select Excel spreadsheet as the file format. The file path is pre-filled with the location configured under Import, Configuration, Location of Import slash Export Files. Under File to Import, select Sales Transactions.xlsx from the list of files. From the list of worksheets, select Invoices. From the list of mapping templates, select Sales Q2. The type of voucher will be prefilled based on its selection while creating the mapping template. You can preview the data to be imported by enabling the Preview Import Summary. Press I, Import, to proceed with importing your transactions into Tally Prime. Once the transaction data is imported successfully, you can see those transactions in your daybook. As you saw, this is how you can easily create and manage mapping templates for importing your masters or transactions from Excel into Tally Prime. Thank you. To know more about Tally Prime features, visit help.tallysolutions.com. 
Subscribe to the Tally Solutions channel for the latest videos.